In the past two years, Palantir seems to have gone from strength to strength, partnering with IBM, AWS, and most recently Google. What do you think this says about Palantir's product? And do you think that this is what Palantir has needed to really hit some scale? Now it's very interesting. First, we saw the IBM partnership, and shortly after that, we saw the AWS partnership, and most recently, we've seen the partnership with Google Cloud. Now the question is, what does this mean for Palantir? I think this is really great because in addition to this list, I thought at some point there was a potential of them working with Microsoft as well. And what this means is if they actually have these partnerships, it's a lot less likely of one of these partners to go out and try and build a Palantir competitor when they've made this relationship and they're working together. So I think it's great in that regard where it sort of might alleviate any potential competition. But what I really think about this is that maybe it might not help Palantir reach the scale they need, but once again, it allows Palantir to get their name out there. And so that if someone is working with AWS, they can discover Palantir for their business. They can use it in AWS. And as they grow, as they mature, as they get even larger, maybe they end up being a client for Palantir Foundry, the entire stack later on. So I'm not sure if these products are actually going to be enough to catapult Palantir to hit some scale as we've been talking about, but I think, I really do think that they could be the start of something really important when it comes to Palantir software spreading across many other different platforms and getting out there. Because I think the scale will come on Palantir's product and platform itself.